Hey everybody, two boys, one, one brain, brain cell. cell. I'm Joel Norton. And I'm Charles Beeson. And today we're checking out another anti-flag song before we see him this weekend. You know what? This is the end for you, my friend. And this is a big one. You punny son of a bitch. This is <clears throat> a big one. Um, I think this is probably their biggest known song. So if you have heard it, let me know. Okay. I've definitely heard this. This right. is on Madden back in the day. Um, so there it. is a chance. I heard it live. Uh, very catchy, but yeah. yeah. You the chance you're still slim because of how I did music back then. Sure, sure. And uh, yeah, it's a common request, guys. So we're just going to jump on in. Let's get it. Well, oh, well, well, let me start off with saying I absolutely love the meaning behind the song. Yeah. And I'm absolutely appalled by the fact that um, it was wrong. What was wrong? It was not the end for all that crap. Yeah. Because it's only gotten worse. Yeah, in, in possibly a lot of different aspects. I also think there's a you know, self consciousness and all with, that. Yeah, I think it's also more in the forefront now. Yeah, where it's like being spread around media wise and whatnot. Yeah, so like it seems a little more like you know in our faces. Yeah, that are we you know grew up and actually you know not oblivious to stuff like that. Yeah, that's fair. Which is, I don't know. That that could absolutely be it. Obviously, we don't know. I don't have this. We don't have the statistics with us to look yeah, at that no we don't. right no um i was kind of shocked to see 
Forty percent of eighth graders were on a fad diet. Yeah, that holy was, shit. This song came out what two thousand nine? I want to say. I'm guessing here, guys. So, holy shit. Yeah, that's that's pretty sad. That is sad. Damn. I never. I, I always liked the song, but I didn't know. I didn't like the video. Adds a nice little. Yeah, it does. Meaning background. They used it well. Throwing in all those statistics and everything. Yeah. That was gnarly. And then still making it a cool, like, live feel video. Oh, yeah. With the... And as far as the song's concerned, it's definitely... I love the upbeat nature of it when it's talking about negative things. Yeah. Yeah, I thought it was just kind of cool they use the video to uh, get a, mm -hmm. across of some important uh, uh, stuff from the... Yeah, some about Anti-Flag, they... They're phenomenal with punching you in the face with shit. Sure, yeah. And I think it's also helpful, too, that it's... Like I had said in some of the other ones, it's kind of like Rise Against, where they have really good message in their lyrics, and they get our point across. I mean, it kind of has a punk sentiment, but it isn't quite punk. It's like a little more mainstream, but it yeah. gets people like you and I. Well, honestly, if we would have gotten to you know restarting this channel when we got into punk music, yeah, and we would have jumped into this, we probably would have been caught, you know, hooked as well. Oh yeah, absolutely. Just from just from the how easy it is to get into some of their music. Oh yeah. Some of the catchiness of it, plus the fact that it punches you. Yeah. Yep. Um, since I've heard it before, I'll go ahead and give a rating. Yep. And it's a flat eight for me, guys. It is in a playlist. Um, it's just really catchy. Uh, this is like one of those songs that I grew up with, like I said, off one of the Madden soundtracks. Uh, I want to say Madden 2006, but I could be wrong. Okay. Um, and basically, it's kind of always stayed in my playlist. From here and there. Yeah. You noticed that you said that you, this might have come out in like 2009, but you weren't sure. And oh, then you shit. just said it was in Madden 2006. You're right. You're right. Good point. Yeah. Now I got to look up when this came out. <laughs> Son of a bitch. I'm going to go with a 7.2 and it's going in a playlist for me as well. You hate to get called out. <laughs> I you know, hate right? To get fucking called out. <laughs> Son of a bitch. I mean, you can't be right on both of them. That's for no, damn sure. <laughs> no. So what did you say, though? Um, I enjoyed the song. I loved the video. Really added a lot to it. I think it's nice and catchy and everything else with it as well. So I was mistaken. It came out in 2006. Okay. I don't know if that's the Madden it was on, but uh, yeah. I can look real quick out of curiosity. Yeah. Cause they, <laughs> I couldn't help but call you out on that either. You did. That was a good catch. That was um, a good catch. Because if you didn't, somebody in the comments definitely would have. Oh yeah, but I I definitely enjoyed it. I thought, like I said, the upbeat nature, the catchiness of the song, plus the meaning behind it is phenomenal. It was a Madden seven. Is it? Oh, so you know how Madden works. It's the year before, yep. so that's the that came sense. out in 06. Yep. So that's uh, where your boy got that. Makes sense to me. Hell yeah. Anything else going on? Nope, guys. Two boys, one brain cell, Joel Norton, Charlie Beeson. Till next time, guys. Peace.